athlete. This is a great experience here in Columbia College. Rockbridge is a tremendous program, got great players. We came down here and gave it our all, and that's all I can ask. I was very proud of our team tonight. The Quincy Notre Dame Lady Raiders are no longer undefeated after a pair of brutal weekend basketball wars on back-to-back -back days with Minden Unity and Columbia Rockbridge. But to Eric Orn's mind, they are in fact better for that experience. Absolutely, a sectional toughness game that we had to grind through today. Had a few shots not bounce out, not go our way, but you know we kept playing hard, and, and that shows our program we're in a good spot. This was a really great team, and especially coming down a two-hour road trip, that makes it even tougher. And we saw a lot more uh, dribble drive, and they had a really good big, too. We'll see that down the stretch, and so now we'll be prepared. Jumping up to play a traditional Missouri Class 6 powerhouse in the Sophie Cunningham Classic. They were amazing games, and that was our biggest thing, is we want to empower young girls to, you know, not only be success successful on the court, but out in the world. And to bring good competition in, it's huge, because we know what girls basketball can be. And so it was important for us to bring in good competition. So not only, you know, Missouri is watching, but you know recruits will come here and see that Missouri has a lot a lot of talent and so it was super fun super successful this is our first year so we did learn a lot I think I haven't slept in three days but it's part of it also served to rekindle some spicy history between those two programs a fact not lost on the Lady Bruins most famous basketball alumna the Columbia community has given me and my sister and our whole family and our friends when we used to play in high school um, you know, great crowds. It was sold out. There was people out the door. And so it's important for us to get teams that are going to travel well so we can create a great environment for these girls to play in, a competitive environment. And, uh, yeah, I mean, we used to play against Jordan Ferrix, and it was feisty up in, you know, Quincy. And so that's what I'm all about. I love it. And, uh, you know, I'm just happy that they want to come out and support girls. I would point out as well that Abby Schreck supplanting Jordan Ferrix on the floor on Saturday as Q&D's all-time leading scorer at a shootout named for Jordan's former Mizzou teammate carries some rich irony to it as well. First of all, Jordan Ferrix is amazing, great human being. She was a heck of a player, um, could have played pro if she wanted to, but she's smart, she has the brains, now she has a family. Um, just a whole around great family, the Ferrix are. But uh, Abby is a stud, like she is absolutely amazing. This is actually the first time I've ever seen her play live and her ability to shoot, her ability to move without the ball, to rebound. Um, I think there is a bright, bright future over there uh, at Missouri. And I said, go break my records, go do something. And, and so I'm a big fan of her and happy she committed to Mizzou.